Five hidden details inside Disneyland's Adventureland Treehouse you don't want to miss. A staple in Disneyland Park since it first opened in 1962, the Adventureland Treehouse has quite a long history. In fact, while it reopened with a new name and a fresh reimagining on November 10th, 2023, this attraction has seen three different versions. The Swiss Family Treehouse until 1999, Tarzan's Treehouse until 2021, and today's brand new iteration. Each version of the beloved treehouse has featured Easter eggs, hidden Mickeys, and fun details that make it even more fun to experience. Now, there's a whole new slew of hidden details waiting to be found inside Disneyland's Adventureland Treehouse. The water wheel is a returning feature. If you remember the original version of the Adventureland Treehouse, then you'll likely notice something feels pretty familiar when you visit the attraction today. At the base of the Adventureland Treehouse, there's a working water wheel, complete with bamboo plumbing that carries water up into the branches of the residence. That water wheel probably looks familiar because it is. It's the original water wheel that was used for the Swiss Family Treehouse. Well, kind of. According to Kim Irving, Executive Creative Director of Walt Disney Imagineering, the Imagineers hoped to bring back the water wheel and discovered Becky Klein of the Walt Disney Archives had it. However, there was a problem. She had it in pieces. So Imagineers took that original water wheel from the Swiss Family Treehouse and created molds from its parts and pieces. They then used those molds to create the new working water wheel, fusing old with the new in a creative way. Tarzan's Jane is back. Okay, technically Jane isn't a hidden detail, she's eye-catching and quite obvious, but inside the Adventureland Treehouse, the Jane you knew from Tarzan's Treehouse is a little bit different. In fact, she's an ostrich. When you climb the first set of stairs into the Adventureland Treehouse, you'll enter the father's cooking space. Off to the left, you'll notice a tall fence and a large pair of eyes watching your every move. And that's Jane, peering over her enclosure. Jane is a fun new animatronic who bobs and bounces around her enclosure. She's also an adorable reference to the previous version of the treehouse, Tarzan's Treehouse. Jane the Ostrich takes over from Jane the Human with a nod in their shared name. Books pay homage to previous iterations of the treehouse. There are so many small details, trinkets, and pieces to examine as you wander through the Adventureland Treehouse. Each room you pass is chock full of interesting and exciting items, but you'll want to pay especially close attention to the books you see inside each one. Keep your eyes peeled as you check out what's inside Mother's Magical Music Parlor, and you might spot two particularly interesting books. A copy of Swiss Family Robinson, which sits on Mother's bookshelf, and a copy of Tarzan of the Apes, laying on the table in front of the couch. These books are meant to pay homage to the previous tenants of the treehouse. The Notes of Swiska Polka In every iteration of Disneyland's treehouse, musical notes have filled the air around the attraction. The Adventureland Treehouse is no different, and you'll notice as you wander through its walkways and branches that tunes play as you pass by each room of the open-air home. However, as you stop by Mother's Magical Music Parlor, pay close attention. If you visited the treehouse in years past, you'll hear a hidden little detail in the music playing. Look closely at the sheet of music sitting on the organ inside Mother's room. It's a hint. The organ is actually playing Swiss Capoca, the very tune that played when the treehouse was the Swiss Family Treehouse. Swiss Capoca isn't only a nod to the Swiss Family Treehouse, it's also a reference to Tarzan's Treehouse. When the treehouse was reimagined into Tarzan's home in 1999, Imagineers kept Swiss Capoca playing, and it could be heard on the bright blue phonograph present in the attraction. And speaking of that bright blue phonograph, when you stop by the twins' room, you'll likely notice the bold turquoise hue of the phonograph inside. Subtle references to the Society of Explorers and Adventurers. The latest iteration of Disneyland's beloved treehouse is a bit unique in that it no longer features a dedicated intellectual property. Instead, the Adventureland Treehouse is home to a family inspired by Swiss Family Robinson, but the family has no specific name or identity. However, Imagineers didn't leave this attraction completely free of any Disney association. Eagle-eyed visitors will spot hidden details that reference a more intriguing Disney narrative, the Society of Explorers and Adventurers. Those familiar with the fictional SEA, and those who know where to look, will spot hidden nods to this special society throughout the daughter's room in the Adventureland Treehouse. As you approach the daughter's space, you can spot a blue and white flag emblazoned with the SEA logo. Inside her room, which is filled with astronomy tools, take a close look at her desk. There you can spot a letter from SEA's resident astronomer addressed to the young astronomy hopeful. Adventureland Treehouse is now officially open for guests at Disneyland Resort, so be sure to check it out and hunt for all these fun details on your next trip. Thanks so much for watching, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more magical adventures.